Hi. <laughs> Go! Step one is the skirt can go over the head or up. When your windshield cracks, tell your insurance provider you want to use affordable auto glass. Uh, you got four screws on either side of this, you pull them out. I'm a worm. I don't have any feet. Oh, look who else has been using the area. Moose. Jim says he sees them out in the clearing out here. They're pretty happy about it because he drops the trees and they can come eat the leaves. Yeah. A common thread for them is that it's really lonely because of the stigma. Greetings, Ertlings. There's a lot of different hats you have to wear besides just, you know, being good at growing plants. And that's a challenging one just uh, in and of itself. And they consume it and they're sort of processing it. Let's give back to the farmers and the local people and the local industry and keep people in jobs. Any plastics, any metals, or any glass is all considered commingled material. I'm a scuba diver and I see the plastic in the ocean, it's there. So if we clean it, we get it out of the waste stream and it won't blow into the waters and all that, it definitely would help our environment dramatically. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in and shut the door. Hilltown Land Trust is a nonprofit land conservation organization that was founded in 1986. Originally run all by volunteers, we have since expanded to have two full time staff. Since our founding, we have conserved more than 5,000 acres on over 45 properties throughout our 13 town service area. An online group claiming it hacked the Washington, D.C. Police Department is demanding a ransom or else it will leak sensitive information about investigations and informants. There's much ahead in this one. There sure is. Just still in shock, really, of what transpired here in my hometown. It could have happened anywhere and I'd still be this upset. But, you know, when it hits close to home, it's just a whole different experience. And hopefully they find who did it and may justice be served. We are supporting with this one loaf of bread and that one pound of flour going into that local bread. It's almost uh, 2 -o, uh, square feet. A barrel being 31 gallons of beer. Then the next number you input is the pounds of grain used. If you're ever daydreaming about a new spirit, say you're going to get into vodka or Univer or whatever, you can just throw in your idea. It's really easy to use. 
and it really helps you connect to your customer. This glass is four square feet of grain field, and that four square feet means a whole lot to the farmer who has to sell 100 acres worth of grain every single year to be viable. That one would. There's such a drive for local food in our area that people have really embraced, which is awesome. Really, a lot of the same concepts apply to, to forests and, and wood products. You know, it's, it's all the same economics and environmental impacts. That's our hope with our business, is to really drive that part of the economy, the local wood, and the connection, too. I mean, John's up the hill there, going to be sitting in his house looking down the hill. It's, it's kind of priceless. <laughs>